फिल्म करने से हॉलीवुड इज डन आई डोंट थिंक सो माई शो इज हैड जस्ट वन सीजन I mean, yes, my television show. I'll take credit for it because it's done tremendously well. It's very, very successful. We've gone to about 210 territories around the world, dubbed in about 56 languages already. Like I was just in France to launch it. We've gone to Spain. We've gone to UK. We've gone to Chile, Peru, Japan. So many amazing countries. And I hear myself speaking all those languages because I'm dubbed in them. And the show is tremendously doing well. So yes, that I will definitely take credit for. But my um film career in america hasn't even started yet i mean so there's no point of me harping on about the fact just because i've signed a movie um that doesn't make someone a star i'm sorry um so i'm going to wait till my film comes out and then you all decide um how that does but yes i have had an amazing acceptance in america people have been incredibly welcoming to me whether it's been the film industry whether it's been the press the media the audience every airport i go to that's the only place i get to go out outside set is an airport so <laughs> mera mera exposure to the world is just airports every airport i go to i get so many people calling me alex and loving the show and and speaking to me in, no matter which country i go to so um it's been an incredible experience but i would say it's just the beginning um everything that has happened to me whether it was maxim hot 100 thrice or the time magazine the time cover or you know my show doing what it has done all of it is just about i truly believe this one or maybe 2% of what respect indian actors deserve in in the world i think we've always been boxed into a certain box ki hum yahi kar sakte hain but we are worth so much more so i want to be able to open up gateways by plowing the world for indian talent to get opportunities coming there and and i i hope they are even more successful than me um but it's going to take time so i'm not someone who's ever planned my career really i'm very instinctive i consider myself an artist not an actor so whenever opportunities come my way mai kar leti hu kyunki mujhe acha lagta hai ya nahi aur ya mai nahi karti hu so i don't know what is next i know it will be something within creativity i did aitraz and i did saath khun maaf and i really enjoy playing villain characters and baywatch was that's the reason why it is so much fun is because it's a comedy so um so basically it is victoria against all six of the lifeguards so the lifeguards have to try and i can't tell you the premise of the story but the lifeguards have to protect themselves and the beach against victoria who wants to destroy them so the entire film is about how that happens and of course the relationships between the two so it's a comedy movie it's not a drama um and obviously with zack and dwayne it will be hilarious um it's a very very funny movie it's going to be a major i think so it'll be a major summer blockbuster next year you all must keep may 19th marked because first of all we've all loved baywatch growing up especially in india and second of all i'm very mean in the film i'm very mean in the film and i don't think dwayne has ever had somebody be so patronizing and mean to him i mean that's what he told me so he does usko samajh mein nahi aata because he can't punch me he can't crush me he doesn't know what to do when i'm mean to him so it's to in fact the whole um, lifeguard squad so it it was a great experience so much fun especially because i could seth gordon who's the director he had made horrible bosses so he has a great sense of comedy as well So we did a lot of improv we did a lot of um you know figuring out things to say jokes on set it was a very collaborative film um we finished shooting the entire film in just about 60 65 days um and uh, yeah so it was great fun and i'm really really looking forward to how people will react to the how people will react to victoria especially because my debut in for the rest of the world besides hindi films is going to be a negative character and i'm taking on <laughs> dwayne and zack who are like the people's champions so i don't know america might not like me very much <laughs> i don't think the indian audience needs to be reminded ki aao mujhe dekho agar unko pyar hai dekhna chahenge dekh lenge nahi dekhna chahenge nahi dekhenge aap kisi ko force nahi kar sakte aao film dekhna dekhne ke liye hamari audience bahut smart hai to main bilkul aisa nahi sochti hu ki oh shit agar mujhe log dekhenge nahi to bhul jayenge i'm not a very insecure person in life in general um mujhe acha project mila waqt mila to karungi nahi mila to mujhe believe nahi hai ki i have to do a film because mujhe dikhai dena chahiye 
नॉट एट ऑल मेरा शो हर सैटरडे आप लोगों के बेडरूम्स में आता है आपके घर पे आता है विथ क्वान्टो ऑन इन इंडिया माई फिल्म बे वॉच विल हैव अ वेरी बिग इंडियन रिलीज आई इंटेंड ऑन गेटिंग द इंटायर कास्ट हेयर वी आर डूइंग अ वर्ल्ड वाइड प्रेस जंकेट सो आई आई डोंट आई डोंट थिंक इट वर्क लाइक दैट टूडे एंटरटेनमेंट हैज़ बिकम वेरी ग्लोबल आप भी तो अपने घर पर बैठ के गेम ऑफ थ्रोन्स देखते होंगे so i don't think people think like that anymore and i love hindi films i'm a indian actor before i'm anything else i say that no matter where in the world i go jo bhi maine seekha hai jo bhi main hu aaj hindi filmon ki wajah se hu aur wo mera training ground raha hai so um jab tak audience mujhe dekhna pasand karegi main filme karti rahungi nahi dekhna pasand karegi khud pata chal jayega the watch is a rated r movie it is a comedy on you know which is which is like that um which is i mean common news because duane keeps writing that on every post about bay watch that he makes but i don't know um apparently the conversations are going in a really great way um it is a certification board and hopefully we'll get certified i hope that happens the pay disparity is not just in the film industry it is a disparity of genders in society in general so the day and a woman's film grosses as much as a male actor's film we'll get paid that much but for that we need the audience to go watch those films so people need to get the gender disparity out of their heads support female actors and say we are going to watch cinema because it's a good film not because it has a female or a male lead so we are in the business of entertainment obviously business is about demand and supply right so when people go watch a film and our films gross as much which now has started happening i mean our films are touching 100 crores and there's so much money that is being made on female led films hopefully the more that will happen the more we'll be able to turn around and say this is our right otherwise it's unfair to for the pressure to be on a female saying that oh your film has never reached those numbers because you're not watching it as much so i think it's a vicious circle which is working towards a better place it's going towards a better place like you said um scarlet's on the list um our hindi films have touched about 100 crores with leading female actors so hopefully we'll get there but you know the the conversations and the battle needs to continue and we need men standing up for feminism that's important